Then Yahweh God made the man fall into a deep sleep, and while he was asleep, he took one of his ribs and closed the flesh up again for a three. Yahweh God fashioned the rib he had taken from the man into a woman and brought her to the man. And the man said, this one at last is bone of my bones and flesh of my flesh. She is to be called woman because she was taken from a man. Two important things the Bible says about woman. Woman or love. Woman are forgiven. Ten Bible promises for woman. You are loved. I have been crucified with Christ and I no longer live, but the Christ lives in me. The life I now live in the body, I live by faith in the Son of God, who loved me and gave himself for me. For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only Son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life. You are not condemned. Therefore, there is now no condemnation for those who are in Christ Jesus. You are included. Consequently, you are no longer foreigners and strangers but fellow citizens with God's people and also members of his household. You are accepted. Accept one another, then just as Jesus accepted you in order to bring praise to God. You aren't alone. A time is coming and in fact, it has come when you will be scattered, each to your own home. You will leave me all alone. Yes, I am not alone, for for my Father is with me. You are wonderfully made. I praise you because I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Your works are wonderful. I know that full well. You are free. So if the sun sets you free, you will be free indeed. You are gods. Yet to all who did receive him, to those who believe in his name, he gave the right to become children of God. You are chosen. For he chose us in him before the creation of the world to be holy and blameless in his sight, in love. Therefore, as God's chosen people, holy and dearly loved, clothe yourself with compassion, kindness, humility, gentleness, and patience. You are no longer a slave to sin. For we know that our old self was crucified with him, so that the body ruled by sin might be done away with, that we should no longer be slaves to sin.